Edward was my friend, Robert. He was my brother in arms. But I fear I've made a, a grave mistake in trusting him. Why, what happened? Wallace is dead. The people are up in arms. There can be no peace. You wanted to be king. Well, you're king now. This is the price you pay. Every man massacred. Your brother was hanged and on and quartered. Thinking about revenge? We swore vows on King Edmund Spygo that we will need to break. The people aren't tired. They are desperate for justice. Wallace got what he deserved. Another feeling. It tears that soul. We should never have surrendered. We had no choice because we had no one to lead us. But it can also be a weapon. Perhaps now we do. We have a crown. We have a king to wear it. I inaugurate you, Robert Bruce. God bless the King of Scots. God bless the King of Scots. You are asking us to support a murderer. Robert the Bruce to be declared an outlaw. Are you a good man? I'm trying to be. It's good enough for me. Any man or woman who would give shelter to him or any of his ranks to be executed without trial. Now we fight like wolves. Fifty men to fight the strongest dog in the world. This is how we do it. Take the lamb back castle by castle. We can unite Scotland. We can win our back. We already tried it. For eight bloody years. And we failed. Because we didn't unite. I wear this crown. As a symbol of my duty to serve the Scottish people. My title is King of Scots. Not of the land, but of the people. I serve Robert Bruce, King of Scots. Join us to free our land! We fight for God, for order, for country, for family. And I do not care so long as you fight! Welcome home, Your Majesty.